In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the four basic formulas to add, subtract, multiply and divide cells in Microsoft Excel. If you find this tutorial useful, then please let me know by leaving a like on the video. And if you get stuck, leave me a comment below. Now let's jump into Excel and get started. To start with, let me show you how to add cells in Excel. The most basic way of adding cells is to simply do this manually. So I have two cells containing the numbers 5 and 15, which I want to add together. In a new cell, I can enter equals, then I'll click on my first cell, then I will insert the plus symbol, then I'll click on the second cell. Finally, I'll press the enter key to perform the calculation. Obviously, the sum of these is 20. The great thing about Excel is that it includes a function that can do this for you. Let me show you how. In a new cell, I will enter equals sum, open bracket, then I'll highlight the cells I am interested in adding together, then I'll close the bracket and then press the enter key. Again, the answer is the same as before. The sum function is particularly handy when you want to sum a lot of values in your spreadsheet. So that's how you can add cells in Excel. What about subtracting cells? Here I have two cells containing the values 12 and 5. I want to subtract 5 from 12. To do this in a new cell, I will enter equals, then I will click on the cell containing 12, then I'll insert the minus symbol, then I'll select the cell containing the 5, and then press the enter key. As expected, the answer is 7. Let me now move on to multiplying cells in Excel. For this example, I'm starting off with two cells containing the values 5 and 20. If I want to manually multiply these cells in a new cell, I will enter equals, I'll select the first cell, then I'll insert an asterisk symbol, then I'll select the second cell, and then press the enter key. The answer is 100 since 5 multiplied by 20 is 100. Another good thing is that there's also a function in Excel that will make this easy to multiply a range of cells. This function is known as product. To do this in a new cell, I will enter equals product, open bracket. Then I'll highlight the cells I'm interested in multiplying. Then I'll close the bracket and then press the enter key. Again, I get the value 100. And finally, let me now show you how to divide two cells in Excel. For this example, I want to divide 75 by 25. To do this in an empty cell, I will enter equals. I'll then select my first cell. Then I'll insert a forward slash. Then I'll select my second cell and then press enter. Obviously the answer is three. So to wrap up, if you want to add cells together, use the plus symbol. If you want to subtract cells, use the minus symbol. If you want to multiply cells, then use the asterisk. If you want to divide cells, then use the forward slash. And remember, there is also the sum function if you want to add a lot of cells together at once. And there's also the product function if you want to multiply a lot of cells together at once. If you found this video useful, please leave a like. It really does help support the channel. If you've got a question, pop it down in the comments below. Also, consider subscribing for more weekly tutorials.